oh, here we are again. Um, I'm kind of waiting to die because I'm curious to see whether or not the game is going to become significantly harder when we die as an emperor. Because we're not going to get primogeniture before we die. I don't, I don't think she's going to make another 11 years. Look at him, he has red eyes like crazy. No, he doesn't. So, I checked out the mods that already exist, and maybe some of this is going to be patched by the time this uh, is released, but there's mods that highlight the characters a bit more, and there's mods that uh, give these distinctive colors in the background so you can easier tell what they are. It's weird, <laughs> but these are some of my major complaints so far. Uh, things are not being super readable. Uh, I've slowly gotten used to the new interfaces, uh, let's check out some of the things we haven't really looked into much. We do have a few republics. They have no individual obligations. Some of them have or something. Succession. Okay, we could go for high partition. So the lion's share of the titles will go to your heir. The rest will be divided amongst our children. Um... Younger children will be given titles starting with those of the same rank as a primary title. If none are available, they will be given lower rank tier. Your player heir cannot be preemptively granted titles that they do not stand to inherit. So this is kind of the same. But direct vassals like us better. And our direct heir. I wonder what it does for the rest. Like, if we click this and say change law. We could also go with the high seniority. Because that one we already have. So, under house seniority succession, the oldest member of your house will inherit all our titles. But we definitely don't want that. We want ultimogenitor or primogenitor. Actually, I want primogenitor. But we could already go for high partition. So let's go and pass high partition law. Oh, I think our guy, he, he converted something. My goodness, aren't you fantastic? Go convert a little bit more. Dude. These are all so slow at what they do. Uh, I feel like we're gonna scoop up all this here, shall we? Let's just get all this here. Done. Let's get two wars going at once. Let another guy lead. Oh, hello. Scrounged up some more troops, did ya? Not bad. However, will they stand against my armies? I do wonder. Doesn't really look like it. He doesn't even seem to have any troops. We'll just breeze through this siege, win this one. Absorbed into the realm. Oh no, our vassal Duke Charles has been wounded. A new lifestyle perk, Peacemaker, Peace Acceptance, plus 10. So playing on speed 3 feels way more natural now, with the sieges being as quick as... I mean, this is crazy quick. This is completely insane. What else do you hold? Ah, the other claims are just not. 
really doable because there's probably a man sitting on that throne. Let's go for this then. We'll take them in pieces. Oh, I already raised them. Pressed too quickly. Let's see, they're gonna have some troops. Not even too few. Or we'll just go for the siege. They want to fight, they're gonna come. Scheme at court. At those sieges, it's so stupid. Well, that didn't work out for you, did it? And what do these belong to? Kingdom of Bavaria, Duchy of Bavaria. Let us create it. Let's see. Don't give him anything. More grandsons here. More great grandsons here. And. You also get the Duchy of Bavaria. How exciting. And you I will grant my great grandson as a vassal. Let's make Bavaria great again. Can't go here. Can go here. I'll go for this. I'll declare war on anyone. Let's just take them out. Make Bavaria whole. A new knight? Ah. Well, you will be forced to lead my armies. Look, my grandsons are fighting as knights in my armies. It makes me all giddy. All excited and happy. That's so cool. Oh, that was that. <laughs> Immediately, army gone. Army gone. They do have an army, which is actually sieging with Onagas. So I think with the French culture advantage that we have, it's kind of crazy strong. All that we throw at the world. And we can enforce demands despite not having 100% because we have this 10 reduction. Okay, we cannot. Apparently. Um, no, there he goes. Did accept eventually. On the clear war, we would break a truth. No. This guy likes us. We'll press this claim. Our empire is growing a little bit too big.
all our knights. Um, what do you belong to? Duchy of Nordgau. Let us create it. Do we have more great grandsons? Yeah. What happened to you? Oh, there's just people overlapping. We're overwhelmed by stress again. I remember granting titles stresses us out. And you belong to... Kingdom of Bavaria. Something happened there, I'm not entirely sure what. I will spend some prestige. And we will spend more prestige. I'll also spend some money in the market. Lose some gold, lose some stress. Ransom. Yeah, we haven't looked into those in a while. Let's see. What's there to be had? 30 gold. Oh, rival now. Lot of upheaval at home. Box. And did your claim on both of these? Ah. Kein. Are you at war with some of mine? Verona Liberty War. Holy War for Lombardia. What are you? The good Catholics. The last Catholics, I think. Pretty much, yeah. There are still some holy sites for us that aren't really in what should be ours. Oh, I think something just broke apart here. I think the Umayyad kind of broke a little bit. Oh, we could do Frankie again. Dear Frankia, what would you like me to take this time around? Did we get the Mercia? But it's so nice that they're right there for us, you know. Don't have to walk far. Can just send in the A team. Deal with it. Duchy of Provence. Cornwall. Really are pretty much everywhere. Crazy people. I think I want to push them out of France. But good. This is where we'll go. 
But of course the real battle happens up here. Take out some trebuchets, We're not gonna send all our knights, just most of our knights. And I hope I have a rally point down here somewhere. Doesn't look like it. Is there no way for me to see those? Ah, this is our rally point here. We'll move it down here. Luckily you can disband gathering armies, so that's nice. We'll do our old trick, split these, select them all, and now we just raise the local army here to reinforce them. Because these don't need much more. Who's leading you? I am leading you. That's kind of fine. You are fighting our vassal, which hopefully is going to go badly for you. Oh look, just created another army there. Will we catch them? No, I don't think so. And we'll just siege this out. Don't you dare attack my vassal. He dared attack my vassal. My vassal is doing God's work. Don't you interfere now. Can I arrive and help him? Not in time. I will not catch them either, or will I? He got him. You could just swoosh in from the side. Our knight and son was wounded. Man. I really like the fantasy part of the whole battle thing. Where you have your sons and grandsons and great grandsons <laughs> fighting in your army. Everyone a ruler in their own right. The battle won. And a valuable hostage cuff they've gotten. Will barely accept it, but they will accept it. So, you belong to the Duchy of Provence, which is not created. And we'll. Give it to this kid here. Which... Where is it? There. Um, let's do an offensive of releasing prisoners just for conversions. Tick, click to exclude from mass... Oh! Mass actions. Mass release. Wait. Mass ransom. Let's do that. Didn't know these were there. Let the spice flow. My god. Rich doesn't even cover it. No! 
Convert and go. Convert, renounce and go. Convert and go. Convert. Okay, stay then. Convert and buy. Convert and buy. Convert and buy. I think I just executed someone, I'm not sure. This guy. We might have released our rival as well, I'm not sure. Does it really matter? So we have eight prisoners left. What happens if you do this? Yeah, they're just gonna get released. No conversions, just releasing. Aubrey Miloni can marry. Princess Marcella. Our grandson can marry our granddaughter. Let's go this with this one here. Chance they become inbred. I mean, isn't there always? I'm not sure if the game is still keeping up with all this. So we've almost pushed them out of France and Central Europe. Punished poachers. Poacher training. Let's get uh, trained by poachers. We're old and wise. Wise beyond our years. We return from the wild. Let's see. We get a better one of these. Yeah, he can be this guy. He's good. Our son really doesn't need a job. <laughs> you can disrupt schemes again. And we need to spread the French culture. Have we forgotten? The errors of the past? Spread it? Spread it throughout the world? They do have some troops, so this might be interesting. Okay. And we'll reinforce with a local army. And immediately march north. How many supplies do you have? I wonder. Could we even get this up to 300? Or do we have to have them standing around for a while? I'll have to check that at another point in time. When we're not actively looking to wage war. Ah, let's let's see our way up. I have a feeling they're gonna fix this. The siege is just too way, way, way too quick. At a certain level.
Oh, it is gonna be a balanced battle. They have higher quality for some reason. Oh, they have camels. Alright. Oh no, we're ill. Come on, you have been good before. Reduced symptoms. Huge boost to health. Very good, court physician. Doing well, doing great. A lot of things were just uh, built. We should. Are you good for anything? Grand Clan of Rankia. There would have to be a child on the throne or something. Uh, let's build some stuff. Paris. Paris. This gives money. This gives money. All of this is kind of fine. With this. Versailles. Money and defense. More money. Ray. Money and defense. And this here has nothing yet. Ooh, all the choices we have. Um, but it's really not much of a choice. We could go with these for once. But I feel manor houses and farms and fields and walls and towers are pretty much the best thing. You want fort level? Yeah, you, you want basically everything that you can get here. No. Our daughter goes free. I don't care what she does. <laughs> it has to be... Oh, look. We reached a agreement. Without further need for bloodshed. Isn't that lovely? And we've done that. Okay, you belong to... Dutch North Umbria, which does not yet exist. Which one of you hates me less? Uh, you hate me less. Duchy of Noroi. Convert. Might accept. Probably wants money. She'll get it though. No. Nope. Doesn't want money. Probably should have done this first. To butter up a little bit. I feel the way I raise my armies is also going to be fixed at some point. Doesn't really feel all that intentional. Clotaire? What hook on Clotaire did we have? No longer ill. Man. She's almost as old as her dear mama now. And as dear mama, she is also a known murderer. <laughs> How old is our air? 49 already. My, my. Where's our fascination with primogeniture? Seven years out. A new martial perk. Let's become gallant at the end of our days here. Prowess, attraction opinion. Gallant and an overseer. Oh, if you don't want to fight me, then I'm gonna go different ways and still fight you. Everyone has pretty much the same. These are all these are all cadet branches from the Umayyad. 
They must be because they all have the bit of Umayyad in there. I like that. That's a cool idea. So you know what great house they come from. We should probably be able to look at our vassals and tell who is what. And I wish I had found the whole... Um... <laughs> ah, we can't demand that for a while longer. I wish I had found the whole... Mass Ransom button a bit earlier. Oh no, our Spy Master is gone. But our son apparently is very well suited for it. A king being a spy master. Have you ever heard of such a thing? Oh well. That's a neat little piece you got there. Would be a shame if something happened to it, eh? Little cadet branch. Time to move these. Oh, I have two down there. Am I silly? No, the other one is just being sieged. And you know the drill. Everyone in there. I would just march. And I shall lead personally. Get some fresh air in. Get a bit of exercise in our old age. So, let's check our vassals. Can we find the cadet branches? We don't see the houses here though. Let's try and get some conversions going. Everyone who has this slightly tilted thing here, I think, is Muslim. I'm gonna accept the ransom. Well, they might not be Muslim necessarily, but they, they're just definitely not of our religion. Try and get all sorts of conversions going. Come on, insular Christianity is best Christianity, don't you know? Why would you even think about this? Just be insular. <laughs> Where is your headquarters? Where did it go? My god, you hold a bunch of stuff in Egypt as well. There. This might cost us a pretty penny. But we're willing to pay for the Lord. I'm just doing it. Because they are smart. Our friend, of course, did it immediately. Ah, wait, we're doing something up here, aren't we? Yeah, our troops are moving. It's all good. Everything's still happening according to plan. Well, they just stood there and took it. Boo of Dunkeld. So, what do we got here? There is a grandson who I still can't give anything to. Got something. This. The little brother. It's all this. Uh, 
Kingdom of Sardinia. Duchy of Albany. Is it there? Kingdom of Sardinia. Where is that even? Yeah. Who holds this? Um. Should we give him that kingdom too? Ah. We might at some point. Let's go ransom a bunch of people, shall we? Get ourselves some money. Because we definitely need it. We are being raided. Who the hell are you? Oh, you came a long way to do that. Didn't you? But I think my vassal is going to take care of this. So what else can we do up here, hmm? Got nothing on you. Oh, we got something on you. Duchy of the Northern Islands. And this is for... Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, yes. Why wouldn't we? So I don't really have anything interesting to say. So... Let's watch the years go by together. Like a real couple would. I don't want to speed it up because it feels like a good speed. Again. You are trying to kill... My son? Jail. Yale! And I don't mean the college. Yale for you. Interestingly enough, you could pronounce Yale like Yale, but it's written entirely differently if you actually talk about Yale. Wow! Hey, Byzantium. <laughs> Yet, their military strength does not grow. They just grow in size. The fearsome Mongols aren't all that fearsome to begin with either. Just all a bit, hmm. I am not impressed, you see. I almost wish for a sunset invasion now. That would throw us a curveball. Then again, would it? Out with the bandits. How oh, dare they. Um, bu bu bum. Do we still have a court physician? Yes. Two. What people do we have? County claim. Learning. County claim. County claim. Outstanding commander, indeed he is. Come to court, my friend. Will not convert. Oh well. Wow. 
Look at him, isn't he fantastic? Oh dear husband. So the guy we just recruited... You will be forced to be a knight. You think we're gonna outlive some of our sons? I mean, we already did, but this one here, he died so young. I mean, one of these two here. That is Adventurer and Treacherous Craven. He has no prestige, nothing. Hey, Scotland, do you even have armies anywhere? We're just sailing around here, taking stuff now. Dutchy, dutchy, dutchy. Dutchy, dutchy, dutchy. Pull the feast. Welcome, friends. Oh. Oh yeah, he has, he has people. He has people, he has this one man here, this one knight. Household efforts. Our husband deserves all the credit. I don't want to be stressed. Faction was created against us again. All of this here belongs to Scotland. I don't even know where to go to siege this stuff. This is gonna be costly. Very expensive to take. Very good. Everyone likes us anyway. You don't like us, so you get lead get to lead troops again. Do you have any sort of army? I mean, yeah, he has somewhere. He has troops. Damned if we know where they are, though. Oh, it might be this ally here that just popped out. <laughs> They're probably still sailing about. There we go. This duke. City of the Northern Isles. Not bad. What can we do with you? Well, you see this man here, he has this claim there. This may, I mean, I do welcome that change. That you don't have to give someone a title before you can press their claims. But it also kind of makes it way, 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 way too easy to just do this. I mean, we're just cleaning up. And it is a little bit silly. There's a lot to like here, but a lot of... Doesn't feel right yet. You know? It's not completely correct so far. Let's just sail. I don't care. Got my war goal. Byzantium can come if they care. Well, that's 3%. <clears throat> this will take a little bit now that it's... Uh, the Byzantine Empire we're fighting. Dull army is moving around there. We'll just let them come to us, I think. They'll land eventually, I'm sure.
Again, a lot of effort for not all that much gain. But we have to start somewhere if we want to take all of Christendom. Can't usurp that yet. It's a very pretty flag though. I like it. Island Empire. How many troops do you have? 12,000. Well, I wonder if you will bring them here or not. I will most certainly come and visit you. Well, there is a lot of war going on. Where are they? Oh, this is not them. Hmm. Where do they come from? Probably up from the south. Ah, no, they're going south. They're not coming north. That's a little bit odd. We can just disband them. Lucky for us. Do we have a rally point somewhere here? <laughs> I don't know. We might. Let me find a rally point. This point. I'm just gonna move him. We'll raise all here. I'll raise a bunch here anyway, not all. Enough to make a different. Difference. Good, that's enough. Dun -dun -dun -dun. And as is tradition, we'll see Jarway North. There are continuously factions being created. Oh look, Crown Authority is actually building some momentum here. Yeah, for what? Rest a claim on me. What can we do with them? Could denounce him? He would hate that. Guess what I can do now? I can imprison you, you fool. See if that works out. Oh, it did not work out. I think I took my rally point from here, didn't I? Yep. So we'll just take this rally point, move it up here, and raise all our troops here. 
And even though they're only the lowest of the low quality, they will be enough to deal with this. I think numbers should be enough here. Alright. Let's send them straight for Byzantium. Still don't know where his troops are. But, you know. Movement speed. Let's get some movement speed. Kill him. It's an even battle. He has all, all the chances in the world to beat us. I mean, definitely had all the opportunity in the world to beat us. There was a bunch of men here, but that's okay. We are here to conquer, and thus the loss of life is inevitably part of it from time to time. Oh, I think we just saw some Byzantine armies here. Hey, this takes a little bit. See what good defenses can do for you. Finally, a bit of a challenge. Things happening, you know. Ah, look. Byzantium has arrived. Can I execute you? Tyranny. Could revoke a title. Nah, he'll just stay in prison. That's his punishment. We have someone better to lead this guy. All our good troops are down here. We'll just siege straight through the world. Wasn't there an option to exclude people? Yeah, exclude him from mass action. Now that's very smart. Very smart. The people we really want to keep in prison, we can keep in prison. I like that. Everyone gets ransomed. That's a very good function. What? He was paid one thousand one hundred eighty four by me. For what? I got that wrong. He gave that to me, not the other way around. Uh, 
Uh, kind of ran past the enemy. <laughs> Let's try not to run past the enemy. Let's see if we can win. A pure low quality levy army in just extremely crazy huge numbers fighting a much stronger army. I don't know where they're gonna go. We'll just have to try and follow around. <laughs> All the while we just keep sieging our way through the world. You're going south. I like how they also look very different. Like these just have a cudgel. And they have a sword and a shield. They're all very cool and stuff. And our primary army is just... Uh, let's take this and let's take that. While our poor levies have to fight the Byzantine army. Their A-team. Getting smashed to pieces here and there. Well, guess what? You will accept. What are we even fighting for? Oh, this, yeah. I've, I totally forgot. Yes, this was absolutely worthwhile. Uh, no waste of time for anyone. In any way, shape, or form. This, this, was, uh, this was the most ideal military campaign in the history of the Empire of Champagne. My goodness, look at all this here. Uh, wait. Who do you belong to? Probably Bohemia. Kingdom of Great Moravia. Ah, that's just... He can have her. What else did we find weird? Steiermark! Well, if that isn't Bavaria, I don't know what is. Speaking of which... Wait, these guys are still free. <laughs> Are you kidding me? There are always claims. Let's move here. This will be the last thing we do today. It's gonna be a bit longer, but we had a few fairly short episodes in between videos rather said I didn't want to say episodes because I feel it's wrong so we can finish strong here And this here definitely belongs to Bavaria. Go. Yup. I don't think I ever had anything as big. I mean, it did have the Holy Roman Empire once, which was fairly big. I think we lost a little bit of land up there due to succession. It felt like something kind of swooshed away there. You, strong vassal of mine, do your job. Man, you made the right friend, did you not? I ask. Did you not? And he still holds a grudge against me for murdering his papa. 
But if I hadn't murdered your papa, you wouldn't... You wouldn't be my vassal. And being my vassal, as you can see... Is kinda what people do in Europe. <laughs> You'd be an outcast. I'd have to go to war. That's a shame. What titles can we create? Duchy, 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 duchy. All kinds of duchies. Alright. Let's end it here. Thank you very much for watching. There's still a little bit of Frank here. Where there shouldn't be. And then at some point we'll have to deal with Romanga. In some way, shape or form. Sadly, no one really has any big claims on it. I would like to just get the whole kingdom absorbed. That would be the most simple solution to the Romanga question. Alright, see you around. Bye-bye. Have a good night.